Hello Luca and for anyone else watching. Um, so Luca, I'm going to go through this question for you. So it looks something like this, where you had a um, circle, which was, is a, a number, we don't know yet, um, and three fifths is equal to triangle fifths. So what we're probably going to look at here is this is a whole number, okay? We don't know what that amount is yet. Um, that is equal to an improper fraction where it's top heavy, the numerator is bigger than the denominator. Underneath you had a table that looks like this. So I've only gone to number four, um, but these are the values for circles. So if the value of circle is one, okay, what's that equal to in fifths? Well, we know, don't we, that if uh, to make a whole, you have to, the numerator has to be the same amount as the denominator. So we could suggest that the, in one whole, so if this here, I'll rub this out for you. If this is one, all right, that means that we've got five fifths here, and all we need to do is add the three. So five fifths add three fifths equals eight fifths. So that one, let me make that a better eight, would be eight, okay? So the answer for that one would be eight fifths. Now if circle was two, how many fifths would we have there? Just have a quick think. So hopefully you understand that because we've got five fifths in one, in two holes, we've got 10 fifths. So if we've got 10 fifths, okay, I'll write that there, 10 fifths in brackets, then all we need to do is add the three fifths. So triangle equals three fifths add 10 fifths, which equals 13 fifths, okay? We'll do one more. So if we have here, I'll do it as a circle. If we have three in there, so the value of circle is three, what's that equal to in fifths as an improper fraction? So we know, well, essentially, if you've noticed, hopefully you have, we've done one times five, that's five fifths, two times five, 10 fifths, three times five equals 15 fifths. Okay, but we've got that extra three fifths there, add that onto this, so three fifths add 15 fifths equals 18 fifths. Okay, perhaps there's a pattern that you're seeing there, maybe, um, and you can possibly spot that going forward. Hope this helps, Luca.